Hey everybody, I hope that you're having a great day and tatting something beautiful today. I just wanted to come on and do a product review that has been way too long in coming. I have had these shuttles now for a while and the, the sad part is when I buy um, shuttles, I wait until after I do my video. So I'm not just using them and forgetting about it. So um, I, you know, had coronavirus and then I got busy with the tat along and everything else. So without further ado, here are the shuttles. <laughs> let's look down, down shot. Here we go. And let's turn on the light. Oh, hold on one second. There we go. My camera was all wapple jawed way over. These are from Nami Art. They come in this very pretty. Oh, come on. This very pretty box, which has Nami on it. Oh, this super shiny has Nami on it. They're super cute. Came in this little box just like that. And also came um, with this really cute paper too. I That's why I saved it because it had such cute paper with a handwritten note. Thank you. So um, I just thought that was super sweet. It also came with this extra little, um, not doily, but <laughs> I can't think of what this dowel, um, of a trial thread. I will say that tr the thread is not my favorite. It doesn't seem to be very tightly wound, um, tightly, yeah, wound together. And this, ex this um, silver piece that is wound throughout seems to want to come apart from the rest of it. I don't know if you can see that very good against the backdrop, but it, um, it, it's not my friend. I, I'm having a little trouble working with it, but it's so cute and it's so nice to just get a free little thing of thread in with your shuttles. So here, as you can see, I was attempting to tap. It didn't work out super great. <laughs> but here are the shuttles. Aren't they just gorgeous? Oh, sorry. That's my pump telling me something. I'm sure I'm low sugared or high sugared or something. But green is my favorite color. And it may not show up super great, but this is a beautiful deep green on a copper background. And what I really like about Nami Art is... She does both sides. So I really, really like that, that no matter which way I'm tatting, I will, you know, have the plain side up usually. I'll make the mistake and have the, <laughs> the plain side up, no matter which way I wind it. And um, this one um, kind of messes with my mind a bit because if you see, if I turn it directly over, the cat will be upside down. So this is a like a flip, a reverse work kind of thing. You know, if I want the cat to be up, I need to reverse my shuttle. <laughs> um, but anyway, just a, a little mind messer. Um, the one thing I will say about them, the slightest, barest, nilest negative I could possibly come up with um, is, let me see if I can find, see on this one, you see how that's slightly bent down? What happened was these are very tightly closed. I don't know if you can see that super great in the in the video there, but they're very close. So when you go to wrap your, your thread, which I'll do in a second, I'll grab some, um, it doesn't go between the blades super easily. So in order to accommodate that, I took my finger on this one and just gently splayed them apart just with my finger just kind of like that and um, the metal is so thin um, and so fine that I ended up bending it quite a bit back you know out of the way and so then when I went to close them again I actually made like a little dimple this is my my work not hers this is not how it originally came um, but I when I pushed it closed again to you can see how I did it there's my there's my finger marks and then see it made it dimple just the barest little bit. I'm sure no one would really notice that much. Um, it's not super noticeable, I don't think. Um, but I noticed because I did it. So I just wanted to be 
honest and open if you're looking at it and going, well, I don't know, it's got a little dent in it. Well, that's me, not her. So don't let that reflect upon your decision of, of purchase. But just be aware that these are very fine, dare I say dainty. <laughs> so for ogre types like me, <laughs> <laughs> who are a little bit uh, bull in the china shop, let's say, maybe we need to um, take it a little easy. These are these are fine and nice and dainty. So, but I love that it's both sides. I love um, that they are um, so cute and so cool to work with. I just love that they're both sides. So I don't ever have to worry about which side I'm tatting with because they're both beautiful. And they come in the loveliest little box with little cushiony um, stuff. And they look like jewelry. I mean, they just, when I opened the box, it came like that. And I thought, oh my gosh, look, I got jewelry. And they do look like little jewelry. And then with this, um, to boot is very shiny. It's a uh, metallic like, it's not a true metallic. Um, it has a, a silver woven in with the green. But I mentioned to her, um, because this one was originally the, the reading, the, the list um, description said red cat with stars. And I sent her a message and I said, I just want to be sure that it's the one in the picture and not the description um, because I wanted the blue one. My favorite color is green. So if you have a green one, I'll take a green one. And um, she responded um, very quickly and said, no, no, the one in, that is the blue one with stars. Um, and so maybe I'm thinking maybe she just read that green was my favorite color and sent me a little thing of green. Maybe that's just wishful thinking. Maybe that's just what she sends to everybody. But I'm going to say I'm special and I got green because it's my favorite color. So <laughs> let me wind one up real quick and I'll give you a little short demonstration with it. And then you can go off to the Etsy store that I will put in the description box under the video and get you some too. All right. So I just quick wound some green because it's my favorite color if you didn't know. <laughs> yeah, I know. I keep saying it. That's why it's funny. Anyway, I just uh, wound some little green thread on there. It tats just beautifully. It is smaller than um, my, some of my other shuttles. A little, a little, I'm going to say daintier. A little daintier than some of my other shuttles. Um, and it, it does a good, this is size 10 thread. So it's a little thicker. So I wouldn't normally put size 10 in here um, because like I said, it's a daintier shuttle. So 10 is gonna take up a lot of, a lot of real estate. Um, it doesn't have a ping because um, of my work of trying to open the blades. Um, so it doesn't, this one does not have a clicking noise, which may or may not appeal to you if you like the clicking noise. Um, but it, it tats up beautifully. It's a lovely shuttle. Uh, it works just great. Um, I haven't tatted with this one yet. I can wind some of our, this is again, size 10, which again, I wouldn't normally use in here, but let's see if we can get her to make a little noise. And of course I'm going to be all thumbs cause I'm trying to hurry. Yep. I'm going to have to, that's my pump telling me, Oh, and I let go telling me something. I'm sure I'm high, low, something. It'll keep going off until I acknowledge it. I'm just going to push my, my fingernail through there. There you go, just to get it slightly open. And you can hear, slight click, just cause it's really tight. And I, ooh, left a long tail on there. Let's get that out of my way. And I always make a ring to check 
just because that's what I do. Well, if I could tap, that'd be something. <laughs> I think I screwed that one up. That's okay. That doesn't look too bad. So there's that one. Again, I love that either direction. It's up. It's beautiful. So I am very, very happy with my purchase. And now that I have done the video, I can actually use them in a project. They are um, very comparable in weight to the, the lighter. I mean, like this one, it's a tiny bit heavier um, than that one. It's in line with Alexi's um, smaller shuttles. Um, let's see if I've got one of Veronica's here. It is heavier than Veronica's by a considerable amount. But it's not um, anywhere near like a, like a Powell uh, shuttle. Um, those are quite a bit heavier. I would say these are not. Um, these I would say are pretty, probably pretty close to um, perhaps knotted vine, um, maybe a little lighter. Um, here's one that we've been using. It's still attached to the end of the cross we were making, but there's um, a Riedel, Rita shuttle, uh, shuttles by design, and they're pretty comparable. This one's maybe just a, a couple hairs heavier the NAMI art one, just a couple of hairs heavier, but they're, they're pretty comparable. They're, I would say on the lighter side of shuttles, but a nice weight for a metal shuttle. They're not too heavy, uh, for a, a metal shuttle and they're not as light as say like a, a wooden Veronica shuttle. I think these are very light. I would consider these very light, um, along with the plastics. Um, these are a tiny bit heavier even than the Veronica shuttles, but, um, all in all, uh, the weight is nice. They are dainty. So I'm going to have to try to tame my ogre ways. <laughs> so <laughs> wish me luck. <laughs> anyway, I hope that you've enjoyed that review and I hope that you will Consider getting some of your own. They're beautiful, lovely shuttles uh, by Nami Art. I will put the description in the, I will put the link in the video description box so that you can go to her Etsy shop and take a look around. Uh, the cats, there are um, different, the kitties. These are cats with stars. There's also cats with swirls, cats with polka dots, I believe. I think there's four different kinds. Um, she has them in black ink, like ink, I call it ink, but it's obviously not ink. Black, black cats on just the plain chrome uh, copper colored background. Um, she has like a, a set of four and then she has them in different colors. Red, I believe green, blue, I hope you enjoyed that shuttle review and that you go get your own NAMI art pieces of art um, shuttles and that you continue to tat on. Stay cool, tat on. You have opposable thumbs and scissors. Have a fabulous day. We'll see you next time. And I don't know why I keep saying we'll see you next time because I'm the only one here, but it is what it is. Have a great day.